Hello everyone, welcome to solve this nice math Olympiad algebra problem. So here we have 4 to the power of c plus 4 to the power of c is equals to 16 and we solve this problem for the values of c. Now you see here uh, 4 to the power of c be the common term. So when you take common 4 to the power of c, we get the remaining values are 1 plus 1 is equals to 16. This equation implies that 4 to the power of c into 1 plus 1 equals to 2 and this whole equation equals to 16. So you see here uh, both of these terms are div divisible by 2 for, uh, so that we can just divide both of the sides by 2 and in the left hand side you see that this 2 and this 2 are gone and in the left hand side we get 4 to the power of c is equals to here you see that this is 2 times of 8 becomes 16 and in the right hand side we get 8 only and now here in the next step uh, in order to find the values of c we need uh, to take or we need to apply the log on both of the sides uh, so that when you apply log on both of the sides it will be written as log of 4 to the power of c is equals to log of 8 and now uh, here we need to apply uh, the nice properties of log and in the left hand side we apply this property of log if you have log of a to the power of m it is equals to m times of log a and uh, here in the right hand side we need this property of log if you have log of a multiplied by b it is equals to log of a plus log of b so uh, we need these two properties of log uh, in order to solve this problem so first we can apply the first property in the left hand side and here we need to move this c in the front of this log and it will be written as c times of log 4 is equals to and here in the right hand side we write this 8 as 4 multiplied by 2. And in the right hand side we can apply the second property of log and according to this property of log we can apply log separately on both of these values and at the last we add these terms in this way this is log 4 plus log 2 and in the left hand side we have c times of log 4 and now for the values of c we need to divide both of the sides of each term by log of 4. So when you divide each of these terms by log of 4 then you will get here this log 4 is cancelled out by this log 4 then we get here c is equals to this log 4 is cancelled out by this log 4 and we get here 1 plus this log 2 is divided by log 4 and here in the denominator term we write uh, this log 4 as log of 2 square okay so uh, in the next step uh, you see here uh, we again apply the uh, property of log in the denominator term and it will becomes 1 plus log of 2 divided by here we move this 2 in the front of this log and it will becomes uh, 2 times of log 2 and you see here this log 2 and this log 2 are also cancelled out by each other and we get here 1 plus 1 over 2 and when uh, you take the LCM of this term then you see here uh, this will become 3 over 2. So uh, this is the our final answer of this question but now in the next step we need to verify this value of C is this value of C is satisfied our given question statement or not. For this we need to copy down the given question statement here and it is 4 to the power of c plus 4 to the power of c is equals to 16 and here we can verify this value and now we need to put the value of c in the left hand side uh, uh, into the exponents of c so it will be written as 4 to the power of 3 over 2 plus 4 to the power of 3 over 2 is equals to 16. And now here in the next step uh, here we uh, write the base of these two terms are 2 square and its whole exponent is 3 over 2 plus in this way we write it as 3 2 square and its whole exponent is 3 over 2 and we check that is this equals to 16 or not okay uh, 
so here we need more simplifications and you see here this two and this two are gone and we get here two cubed plus this two and this two are also gone and we get two cubed and here we check that is this equals to 16 or not and now you see here two cubed equals to eight plus this two cubed is also equals to eight and we check that is this equals to 16 or not so 8 plus 8 becomes 16 equals to 16 and this shows that uh, the value of c is equals to 3 over 2 is satisfied our given question statement so this is our final answer of this question and i hope so you like this method but if you have any other method in your mind uh, so please don't hesitate to write this method into the comment section and thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos.